Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Oke Doke. Now today, we're going to be doing something just a little bit different. Uh, as you can see, I have a new apparel to wear in this America. My auntie Wanjera sent it to me from the Kenyas through um, one of my other relatives, of course. But if you guys are ready for today's episode, we shall get started in three, two, ah! You, you thought that I was going to make a new intro. No, it's still the same thing. Roll it! So today, I wanted to take some time out of my day and talk about this Halloween. Now this Halloween is coming up very faster faster. It is next month and I, it is too early to talk about this, but I'll probably talk about this in the future regardless. Anyway, this holiday spooks me from the inside out because of all these shooting stars roaming around the streets dressed as a hooligan or a, um, one of those flying bat creatures, um, uh, the, 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 the bat chappas or something. So. What I'm trying to avoid is having people come over to my house dressed over as uh, chickeness and, and, and all these bad things. I want to take them out of this house and bring goodness with the name and the press and the help of my dear friends, family, and of course to Jesus. We will Get through this and we will let people know that you should not come to the Oke Doke house, right? So, apart from that, I have seen some chickiness in my day. Once there was this, um, back in our village, there was this, uh, boy. His name was, um, Anthony. Huh? And this Anthony went over and he went house to house and in our village, no one did Halloween. No one does Halloween because it is a fiendish holiday. So he went over and then some people, uh, he went, um, boom, boom. Now most people thought it was the police uh, going over and, 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 and checking the, the routine house checks. And <clears throat> what had happened is that he was suspected for. And since we didn't have any cameras back in the day, we had to use our minds and our minds taught us to get the broom, uh, to take the top off. Uh, some of us got our mops, uh, they were wooden. Uh, we call that the mega chopper stick. When you're doing bad, you bring it out and then you, you resolve things um, um, crossways and perpendicularly. So we chased this Anthony out, out onto the street. He, he didn't get run over by any cars because um, he was a very smart boy. He ran and he ran and he ran, okay? I almost ran too, okay? Because I saw it amongst the street and he was my best friend. Then I ran to go get some help for him. Uh, no one would have him in the village. We had to go to the house. We had to go um, to, the, uh, to the church to pray for him. And that is why I do not like Halloween. Eventually he got cut. Uh, it, was a, um, it was a drawn out case and he never did it again because he was very scared for his life. So, Maybe here in America it is nice and a nice tradition and everything. And Derek sometimes likes to, uh, in some years he's liked to go out and do those chickenesses. But in this house, not anymore. So, in that, I am not telling you that you guys should go out for Halloween. Enjoy your free candy. If it has poison, I guess enjoy it then. But I'm just warning you, this is an okay dokey warning. I'll see you all next time in the next episode. Bye bye, okay?